Hello everyone, welcome to Ankit Math Magics and this YouTube channel is all about the concepts of mathematics, the concepts of electronics and the concepts of computer science. So in this video we will be discussing about a really really interesting logic gate that is the exclusive OR gate also known as the XOR gates. Now in some books it is written uh, like this and some books you can have the exclusive OR uh, the complete definition or the complete name like this. So in this video we will be discussing about its logic symbol, its truth table and some short tricks on how to remember the output. But before that let me request you to please subscribe to our YouTube channel as it gives us the confidence to come up with better videos every time. So let's start the solution to this video with a big smile on the face. All right. So here we have the uh, case of the exclusive OR, also known as the XOR gate. Now, the thing is that the digital electronics or the digital systems uh, to be in particular, they basically operate on just a digit, uh, just two digits that is one and zero known as the binary digits. So the exclusive OR or the even the exclusive NOR gates, they are basically the combination of the other logic gates that is the AND gate and the OR gate and the inverter. However, because of their fundamental importance in many applications, the exclusive OR and the exclusive NOR. Now these two gates are treated as the basic logic gates and they have really a unique symbol. So the symbol goes like this that first we draw one curve like this, then we draw another curve just uh, in kind of a parallel situation to like this and then we continue with an OR gate. So we draw the symbol just like this. All right. So from this end we can take our output which can be taken as X in this example and then there can be two inputs that is A and B. So this is the logic symbol for the exclusive OR gate. But there is a kind of a twist to the story right here. So as you know that in the previous videos or in the previous concepts, you might have learned that there can be multiple inputs to an AND gate and an OR gate. But the exclusive OR gate or the XOR gate can have only two inputs. Yeah, yes, that's correct. So you have to keep in mind that the XOR gate can have only two inputs. And the, even the truth table for that matter is fairly simple. So for two inputs, we can have A, B and X. So for two input format, we know the sequence that is this carries 0, 1, 0, 1. And this one will have 0, 0, 1 and 1. So the output uh, basically is decided by the operation of the logic gates. So the logical operation of an exclusive OR gate can be taken as follows that the output of the exclusive OR gate is high only when the two inputs are at opposite logic levels. So if you have 0 and 1 kind of a combination, maybe 0, 1 or a 1, 0 kind of a combination, only then the output will be 1. For same input combination, that is if you have both as zeros or both as one, the output will be uh, zero. So this in a nutshell is the truth table for an exclusive OR gate. And since we know that this does not have more than two inputs, hence this is the full and final table for the XOR gate. So always remember that you will have an output of zero and an output of zero only when the two inputs are same and if the two inputs are different then you can have the output as one fine so this in a nutshell is a very simple definition of the xor gate and uh, for more such videos you can kind of subscribe to our youtube channel for more videos related to mathematics electronics and computer science thanks for watching